Hey guys, so here is uh, a video for the DJI Vision Plus, how to hook up the, you know, your smartphone to the Wi-Fi repeater. So first off, you just got to power on your Phantom first, then you go to your menu setting. And right now, I'm using a Samsung Galaxy Note 3. So depending on what phone you have, it may be the same. So you want to go into your settings, go into your Wi-Fi uh, setup, and hook up to your Phantom. So you can see, I'm already connected to the Phantom. Once you have the Phantom connected to your uh, Wi-Fi, you want to download the DJI app, DJI Vision, open that, everything pops up, and you can see camera. So it takes a few seconds for it to actually kind of connect. But you can see right now, the lag is not that bad at all. I mean, I move it, it's, it's kind of stabilized too, but it's actually pretty instant. I think it's a little bit quicker than the original Phantom uh, Vision. But I'm not exactly sure if I remember correctly, the Phantom Vision did have a slight, slight minor lag. But you can see the yaw axis is stabilized really well. I mean, I'm moving it back and forth and it's pretty cool. So one thing I did notice was out the box, it did, came in, or it did uh, come in FPV mode. So you can see here with FPV mode check. So what happens is when you roll it, like so, you can see the image rolls. So I guess this is good if you like to have that dreamy look when you're flying, kind of that, that motion kind of rocking look. So it's not really true FPV mode, but it does give you that motion look. So let me go ahead, disable that. And also another thing that I learned from the Phantom Vision is, depending on where you're flying it, I find it the best to be in 240 at 30 just because the, the signal is a little bit, it's less bandwidth going through, so you just less breakouts when you're flying it. But in return, you can see the video quality reduces when you're looking at it but it's not that bad and right now it's kind of I'm in a low lit uh, you know place but you can see it's still the same just a little bit darker but you still see a lot of the pictures and give you guys a demonstration of how well this setup works here let me focus out oh so right here so you can see stabilizing stabilize but when you move camera moves with it so that's very nice we got the rock in we got the yaw compensation so very neat um yeah you can see it's pretty cool just want to give you guys a you know closer look at the smartphone app how much the lag is not too much of a lag at all and how stabilized you know this thing works and you can see the pan works very cool <laughs> and earlier in the video i was doing this the whole time when you guys were looking at the video and you can see, you know, the video just looks nice and stabilized on all three axes. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, guys. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for some more videos coming up very soon. If you guys want to see any more videos of this new DJI Vision Plus, any specific video, please feel free to leave me a comment in the comment box below, and I'll try my best to get those videos for you guys. So, thanks for watching, guys.